Good morning, Jags. This is Cadet Major Kaylee Zudema from your Jaguar Battalion. Would you please stand for the pledge? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I'm Issa with Jaguar News Daily. A few new announcements. Any young ladies interested in coming out for the district champion girls weightlifting team should come to see Colonel Navarez's classroom H21 tomorrow morning at 7.10 before school. Beginning Wednesday, September 7th, the Jaguar Book Club will host its first meeting in the Media Center at 2 p.m. It's open to all students and will meet weekly to analyze and discuss literature chosen by the group. Please see Mr. Georgia in H12 or Mr. Allen in H5 for applications. Anyone interested in joining the girls' basketball team, there will be a brief meeting after school next Tuesday in room H25. See Coach Lane for more information. If you are interested in being a freshman class officer, you can pick up an application in room 136. Applications are due by the end of the day tomorrow in room 136. There is a fall baseball meeting after school today in room 119. There is a junior class meeting today after school as well in room 407. There is a HOSA meeting on Friday right after school in room 431. See Ms. Kozak for more information. Any boys interested in soccer, see Coach K in room 406 for information. Conditioning starts next Monday. And if you're interested in taking a free driver's ed course right here on campus, you must sign up online. Just visit atreasurecoastdrivingschool.com. The class begins Monday. Good morning students. I want to give all of our students a update on where we are in the second week of school regarding consequences for any type of situation that may have occurred. So of course with tardies, if a student has totaled three tardies, then they will be getting an after school detention on Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday. So make sure that you're not tardy for any one of your classes. Keep walking in those hallways. If you stop, what happens is the people behind you can't get past you and a lot of our hallways are very small and if that's the case you create a backlog. So please keep walking, please uh, walk to your next classroom so that way you can be on time and then keep everyone else in school uh, for being on time as well. Students, we are looking better first thing in the morning so students please give yourself plenty of time to get to school in the morning. Soon that gate will be shutting at exactly the bell. So when the bell rings, that gate is going to shut and students will then have to go through JAG services and pick up late. So right now we're giving you about a minute, two minutes until we close that gate, um, but that is quickly going to end. So start adjusting your times, get plenty of sleep at night, so that way you can go ahead and wake up refreshed, ready to come to school on time. Um, students in dress code, we are giving um, uh, students who are out of dress code, lunch detention, so I started seeing kids go to lunch detention and we do have the bagged lunch, lunches this year, so make sure you don't eat one of those or have to eat one of those bagged lunches and serve your time in the lunch detention room. I'd rather you be out with your friends enjoying your day, so please make sure you come to school in school appropriate clothing. This Friday we are going to have our PBIS incentive for the class that is 100% in dress code and 100% on time. So teachers, make sure you email Dr. Belgraves if your class is 100% on time and 100% in dress code and your class may win a pizza party. Look forward to being there with that class and enjoying that pizza on Friday. Let's take a quick look at the forecast. Clear and hot today with a high around 89 and a low of 79. A good chance of afternoon showers. That's all for Jaguar News Daily. Have a great day.